Hey guys, so here's the gauge cluster I've been making on custom for my 72 Triumph GT6. Um, it's running in simulator mode right now, but it will be obviously working fully from the car, and it actually already does. Uh, it plugs in to the CAN bus for things like the RP, engine RPM uh, and boost values and a few other things. Uh, and then it has 12 analog and digital inputs for other things like the uh, fuel sender and that kind of thing. Also shows, you know, obviously your inside temperature through a, a temperature probe that's on one of the circuit boards that I made. Um, shows things like your fuel value, all your normal gauges that you would expect, uh, warning indicators, battery, um, oil pressure, uh, engine coolant, and the boost over here with a uh, lagging max indicator. So yeah, it's also a touch screen, so you can do things like uh, reset the trip just by pressing the button. Uh, that doesn't work right now, obviously, because it's just in simulator mode, but normally that works. Um, one cool thing though is I can go into, because it's a touch screen, I can have different screens on here. So for example, if I touch the Triumph logo, it actually moves into a diagnostic page where I can see all the diagnostic values from the car or whatever I specify, you know, I can change this. And then we can go back. Um, to the normal gauge cluster. Uh, the screen flash is red for shift light right now. Uh, I may change that, I don't know. Had to rebuild pretty much all of this area because it's not made to fit an LCD like this. It's made for old analog gauges. So um, a lot of custom sheet metal work to redo this whole enclosure as well as the top of the dash. This will all be covered with foam and leather and this is all covered with wood. So you won't see any of this when it's done. And that's it. Hope you guys like it. Thanks.